All right, so we just finished up Amelia's training. So to the next one we go. Whoa, uh, Elton, I hope you're not waiting for me. Oh, jeez, sorry. Carry on, sailor. Damn. <laughs> the hell are you two up to? That's weird. Those guys just left all their stuff out here. Wonder what happened to them. I don't know. Let's see what we can find first. What the hell are you guys doing? Let me go! What to do with small bully assistant? Jeez, I don't know. Could you put him in that deadly Nelson you were talking about? Could. On such tiny opponent, all blood might drain out ear holes. Ah! Shut up, Benny! On other hand, blood from constricted trunk could rush to tongue. And? Tongue swells, pops. Most blood drains back down throat. Interesting. Less mess that way. Mouth stuffed with giant tongue can't scream. So quiet. Ah! Uh, shut up, Benny. You have something less drastic? Well, could use half deadly Nelson. What's that? Like the like Nelson, but less dying. How much less? Easy. Half. What happens the other half of the time? Opponent leaves. Spends the rest of short life praying for death. Hey! Can you hear me down there? Maloof? Shut up, Benny. Seriously, Maloof. I apologize. A call off your goon, and I'll never bother you again. Ever. The thing is, Benny, you're never gonna bother me again either way. So you're gonna have to offer something a lot better than that. Like what? Any ideas, Mikhail? Know anything about giant hairless beer? No. Out of ideas. Preparing Nelson. Well, wait, wait. Uh, maybe. Uh, yeah, maybe I did see something like that. Uh, give me a minute to think. You ready to talk, Benny? Hold on. It'll come to me. Okay. Y'all have fun with that. You know, Chloe, for a chick whose face I can't see because she's always wearing a helmet, you're pretty cute. I'm not human, Earth Primate. But you are the girl model of whatever it is you are, right? Affirmative. At this point, that's totally close enough. Man, what smells like butt? Oh, hey, Nils. How about you and your butt and its odor take a hike before I puke? But... It'd be a real shame if you had to leave your butt here because it was anchored to my foot. Now beat it! Hi, Chloe. <laughs> How is it, uh, in, I mean, 
you know, what's up and stuff. Bobby, we need to work on you a little. Okay. <laughs> And I got an achievement for that. Hmm. That works. Just found a PSI challenge marker. Every time you find one of these, your PSI cadet rank goes up. Rank up enough and you'll get a new PSI power. Sweet. Now I gotta get back out. and mental agility. I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for Pyrokinesis. Kinesis lesson. Lesson? Shh, now, now, think of something you'd like to burn. Everything. Oh, yes, I heard you were raised <laughs> in the circus. Uh, but why would you want to burn all these happy memories here? If they were happy memories, I wouldn't have run away. My dad, he hates psychics, and he knew I was becoming one. So all day long, he would force me to practice my acrobatics, hoping to distract me, or maybe hoping to kill me. I never was sure. Now why are you still talking when you could be burning stuff? Okay, um... Focus? No, that's right. Mental focus on this last one and hold it while you use your pyrokinesis power. Think hate. Why can't I target? Okay. Excellent work. Fire is pretty. Okay, that's the end of the lesson. You're free to go, but. You have to promise me, only use your power of pyrokinesis only when it's very, very important, or it's really, really entertaining. <laughs> I promise. And if you're doing it to impress girls, make sure none of them have on a lot of hairspray. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I need to make some of those, uh, PSI orbs. Not that.
Damn. Sweet. Now to get back out. So much easier. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crowler? Uh, let's see. Let's go. Is it on here? There it is. Bring me near the geodesic psycho isolation chamber. Roger that, Ranger Crowler. Why can't I just go to the one inside? That's... No, seriously, why can't I go to the one inside? It always kicks me to the one that's outside. But not to the one inside. Huh. I don't know what it is, but I want it. It's a fossil. Okay, okay. I'm a certified limitator now. Ready to roll. Hmm. I've been running some tests. It seems that the sensitive circuitry of the brain tumbler is picking up too much psychic interference to be safe. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level, which explains many of the strange things you've seen. I must call off the experiments until we know more. Sasha, there's no time. I think my vision about Dogen came true. I'm worried it's gonna happen to the others, the others if we don't get to the bottom of this quick. But we don't know where the foreign projections are coming from yet. Is there a faster way to find out than sending me in there to investigate? Going in. 